with the dignified Windsor Castle in the background, the coaches stopped for their run. In these days of modern transport, we are apt to look only for speed and the power, and we lose all the beauty of that almost forgotten mode of travel, the coach. Yet what can be more beautiful than the stately and rhythmic movement of a team of prancing horses? What can be more exhilarating than a run along sweet and fresh country roads with the team responding to every touch or word of the driver? In this marathon, time was the least important. Points were awarded for the general standard of coachmanship, the condition of the horses and coaches and equipment, both before starting and on the completion of the run. Miss Colbrook won the cup for the best road coach, and the trophy for the best private coach was awarded to Mr. Bertram Mills. The Honourable Mrs. Breton made the presentations.